Hey folks, Crazy Glamorator here again. And this time we're going to look at a game called Alpine Ski. And this was created in 1982, early 1982, I think January 1982, by Taito. I remember seeing this in the arcade the same time as another early 1982 game, Zaxxon. They were both at uh, an arcade called Astrocade, which was in the Tigard, Oregon area in uh, the Canterbury Square uh, Outdoor Mall. But uh, it was in the parking lot, and uh, it was gone by the mid-'80s, but I remember both games were there. It was a teeny, tiny arcade. But um, this game is, is pretty cool. As far as I know, it's the first arcade game of skiing. Um, I thought it was pretty neat for its time. Um you have a button to uh, propel your skier forward and your goal is to just uh, complete a course in time get to the finish line uh, before your timer runs out and uh, you can trip over bushes and trees and rocks and other skiers or uh, snow plows but uh, yeah your goal is just to get to the end in time and the first there's three different uh, three different courses to complete one is simply the uh, the slalom just get to the end the second is uh, the uh, obstacle well it's not an obstacle course but it has flags and you want to uh, try not to run into the flags but there are extra points you can pick up by skiing over the point values like 100 the tricky ones are the most and those are often uh, ahead of a patch of ice do not go through the patch of ice at an angle or uh, you will definitely run into something if you run into something you trip over and you fall face first into the snow and lose 10 seconds off your time. If you run out of time, your game is over. And, uh, uh, like I said, the second, uh, the s crap. <laughs> the second course is, uh, you go through the flags, or between the flags, and, uh, get to the finish line. Then, uh, the third, uh, the third course is, is a jump. You go down the hill and you jump at just the right time and try to land somewhere in the center. Just build up as much speed as you can and get a lot of points. Now here, you want to go, you want to try to knock, not to knock over the flags. Position yourself right. Now you can miss almost all the flags. Each hit flag uh, takes off a hundred points from your score. Now there is a trick on <laughs> on this game in which you can roll your score under zero by purposely hitting the flags. And uh, it'll roll back over to uh, just under a hundred thousand. <laughs> and you can really get a nice score that way. Um, by letting your time run out and uh, your game would end with a super high score but uh, this is the second course yeah you just you just judiciously press the the speed button here and there not all the time because you can easily run into things and now we go on the ski lift and we do the next course this is the downhill one. Just hold down the button and press it again just before you get off the uh, jump. And then just aim for the center. And you can get 4,000 points for your bonus. And then you start all the uh, courses over. And your time is... You get a little extra time added on for each completed course. 
but you really have to really have to pour on the speed later on and the uh, the computer uh, skiers or the snow blowers are extra clumsy and seem hell-bent on running into you or something this game is pretty hard uh, for for beginners well I ran out of time cuz uh, you hit something and you lose 10 seconds well that was actually not a bad score I made it through the three uh, courses. Now in a minute I'll show you what it looks like to roll your score under by purposely running into the flags on the second course. Now I guess your game is supposed to be able to end when you run out of time. See it's minus a hundred points each time I run over the flag. Um, it That didn't happen the time that I tried it. It didn't say game over. Um, but, uh, I don't know why that happened. Maybe, uh, maybe I needed to use, uh, ROM set 2 of Alpine Ski. I was using 1. Let's see, look at my score now. It's gone, uh, it's gone, well, it's gone just under a, a million points. But try not to pick up the, the extra point icons if you're, if you're going for the super high score. But uh, you're supposed to have your game end if uh, if you see there I ran out ran it down to zero. That should have should have made my game end and me have a super high score. Well, you can try and see what happens. But that was Alpine Ski by Taito in 1982, January 1982. Fittingly, because this is a winner-based game. This is Crazy Climb Radio saying thanks for watching Alpine Ski by Taito in early 1982. I will catch you later with another video. Have a good one. See you then. Bye-bye.